Here's why I think Russ is underrated. Without a question, he's one of the biggest artists in the world. He's ranked 379th on Spotify. There's very few artists out there with a fan base like Russ, and there's very few artists out there with a catalog as large as Russ's catalog. He is, in my eyes, probably the smartest artist we've ever seen on an independent level. Only reason I believe he doesn't get all the flowers he deserves is because his fan base doesn't necessarily reside 100% in culture. And when I say culture, I mean the culture of hip hop. He has very few fans within the community that fuels hip hop as an industry. Russ has been very adamant in interviews about not wanting to play industry games. The only problem with that is that you can never be regarded as a top tier artist if you don't want to compete within the realm of the industry. Here's an example. If LeBron ever wanted to be regarded as the best basketball player to ever play the game, then he would need more rings than Kobe and Michael Jordan. And he would also have to do it within the NBA. If he did it in a different league in an entirely different country, would it matter? So to recap a little bit, culture is hip hop and hip hop so happens to be the biggest genre in the music industry. So it also means that if you wanna be considered a top tier hip hop artist, you gotta be willing to play mainstream games because being the number one hip hop artist means you're mainstream by default. One simple change that I believe Russ can make that can bring him closer to that number one spot but not necessarily be number one is just being more involved in culture. That would mean you would have to actively be in places where the culture lives, such as the clubs, the hoods, and hell, Kanye even showed us recently with the Donda album that the culture resides in the church as well. But all in all, I think Russ has done a really good job with his career thus far. He's still considered a really good hip hop artist in my eyes. I also think he's a genius, very smart, well beyond his years, best selling book. This book right here in particular is a must buy. On this TikTok channel, I'm mainly here to give flowers where it's due and also criticize wherever the critique is needed and unbiasedly analyze the trajectory of each artist I cover. Russ is an independent artist. He does it his own way. And a lot of times we choose to be independent because we don't want to be in compromising situations. Follow if you're interested in watching more in-depth analysis on your favorite artists.